Hello, Sharon Jarl Kubot here with West USA Realty and Arizona Retirement Communities. I'm over in the retirement community of Sun City Grand. Going to give you a tour of one of the homes here that you picked out today. Going to do a tour of four of them here. And this is the first one here. And uh, I wanted to uh, kind of, this is the one that backs up to Mountain View. A very nice home. So that's why we're doing the video. I said that uh, do a video of, on anything that I thought was a uh, a very nice home. You're uh, on track to close on your home there soon and so hopefully uh, we can get uh, get a nice home here picked out for you. So this home sits, this home is a north-south orientation, sits on the uh, south side of the street facing north. Okay so hang on to your eyeballs, gonna give you some live raw unedited lots of blooper video here. So uh, this home was built in 1997 it's 1,627 square feet. Nice home. Pricing seems to be right. Very well maintained. It has a good paint on the exterior. And uh, pardon my phone, like I told you. Live raw and uh, lots of bloopers here. So let's, uh, we'll get back to the video here. We'll take that call later. <laughs> Sorry about that. So anyways, again, it sits on the south side of the street facing north, built in 1997, 1,627 square feet. Okay, laundry's in the garage on this. We've got that good elastic numeric paint on the exterior. Seems to have been a little settling in the past, but nothing like some of the other homes that we've seen. Just only on one side of the house, and I'll show you what I'm talking about here as we continue to walk around it. So here we are uh, looking down the street to the west. And here is looking across the street to the north. And looking down the street to the east. Very nice neighborhood. Very clean, very well maintained, uh, well as is all of Sun City Grand. Very nice landscaping on this yard. You could put a really nice front uh, courtyard up here if you liked. And uh, the, the AC heating system will be, uh, uh, was, was done in uh, uh, 97, so it's original system, but uh, everything seems to be good. But you'll have that inspected during the home inspection. Laundry's in the garage, they got a laundry tub. There was a laundry room inside. I don't know if they ever utilized it as that, but it's right on the other side of the door going in. Because your garage faces north, you do have an insulated garage door. There's no direct sun on the garage door, so uh, it'd be a, a fairly cool garage to do your laundry in. But lots of nice built-in cabinets, workbench up there, and you do have that nice extended garage as well. Like I said, it is an insulated garage door. A little rusty here in my videos this morning, so please uh, forgive me. Again, the house looked like it was repainted recently. The siding, uh, the, the exterior stucco is very good condition. It is a wood framed home. Uh, some of the homes that we looked at were all block construction, I believe. And then this is the mountain view here. Um, again, it's it's not that busy of a street, a little bit of traffic, but not bad. Very nice landscaped yard here. Now Mountain View drops down a little bit, and you can see that this inclines down towards Mountain View. and we are looking south here. Here's your neighbors to the west of you. They got a very nice backyard. Looks like they live here year-round. You got a very nice 
covered the patio here. They've extended the uh, soffits a bit, or the overhang of that patio a little bit. And that the extension that they did is aluminum. Looks like they st extended it um, two, maybe three feet. And then here's the side of your home here. This is the only area that I've seen, and nothing like what we'd had before, just a little bit of maybe settling. Uh, you'll see, a, um, it's kind of hard to see off the video camera, but just a couple areas there, but nothing like what we've seen in the past, and they've maintained it very well. Got gas coming in, here's our sprinkler system and our 200 amp electrical panel here on the side. So let's take you inside here. Nice open floor plan. It does have a white carpet. The carpet is very clean inside. You've got uh, nice white tile floors as you first come in. Carpets, uh, again, very good condition. Nice big windows looking to the outside. You don't hear any traffic when you're inside here at all. And here's looking down the hallway. Maybe the only thing that you might want to add some tile going down the hallway and stuff, but the carpet, even for a white, real light colored carpet, it's a very good condition. And it's white walls, but it wouldn't take much. You got a very clean slate to add what you'd like to add inside here. Nice breakfast bar there. Looking back towards the front door, and then you're done there. Took lots of pictures of inside the garage and the outside of the yard as well. We'll email you the link for those, but for the pricing on this house, uh, very nice home. I think you might, uh, again this carpet's very good condition, but you might eventually do a little bit of tiling going down the hallway. It wouldn't take much to do that. You got nice tile laid on the diagonal in the kitchen here and the entryway. You got blonde cabinets, excellent condition. You might, uh, I think the dishwasher's original, but I think the, uh, the refrigerator's been, uh, well I, I'd say that's probably original as well. Again, a lot of uh, raw, unedited, live, lots of blooper video here. Appliances are original. They look uh, very good condition. Here's your den. And then here's looking down the hallway. This first uh, opening here takes us into our master bedroom. We got uh, nice double closets in this hallway here. Yeah, nice bay window here in the master bedroom. Makes it uh, nice and large. It's a queen size bed that's in here. And then we do have uh, we do have carpet in the uh, master bath as well. That wouldn't take much to tile, but uh, again, you might probably going to want to do that. We got the higher countertops here, double sinks. And again, it's kind of hard to do this off of video camera, but I did take lots of pictures. Nice, large uh, master bedroom closet. A 
Hopefully we're not making you too dizzy here today. Going to 109 degrees today. Perfect. And then here's your double closet that I told you you had uh, before you stepped into the master bedroom. And then here was what was originally planned to be the laundry, ro or laundry room. It is tiled. But there's no water hookups and I can't see where they would have patched it. So I don't know if the plumbing is in the walls if you did want to change it back. And then a nice size uh, second bedroom, your guest bedroom here. With just your standard size closet. Your guest bath here has uh, uh, again the higher countertops, mid-rise toilets, does have tile in this bathroom and uh, just a full shower and tub. Kind of a very quick uh, informal video but it'll help when you uh, sit down and look at it, uh, the pictures along with the video. Again, if you've stumbled into this video uh, looking for a home for yourself on an Arizona retirement community, my name is Jarl Kubat with West USA Realty. I specialize in selling homes in active adult retirement communities throughout the Phoenix metro area. You can visit my website at www.justjarl.com. That's J U S T J A R L.com. You'll find over 50 plus links uh, to communities throughout the valley with the current listings and price reductions within each community. Sharon, I hope this video helps you out. I look forward to uh, getting you here as you unload your moving truck here in the near future. And uh, you can reach me at 480-710-6326. Uh, thank you for the opportunity to work with you, Sharon. And again, if you've stumbled into this video, I look forward to meeting you in person, and I'd appreciate your business. Thank you.